they call Moby Dick. <laughs> We've been at sea for what seems like years. <laughs> the men are growing cantankerous and do not come when I call them. My dear esteemed husband, have you tried calling the Mishmail? <laughs> ah, I call them late for dinner, that's what I call them. I know if it were me, I'd mandate a routine of fresh daily bathing. There's a real mandate. <laughs> <laughs> you might want to try a dip yourself. I could not read your letter, Mrs. Ahab. The ink was all wet and smeared. Never mind. As for the morale of your crew, perhaps an evening of lively music with some dancing might mitigate their gloom and brighten their poor souls. Dear Mrs., there's nothing wrong with a song or two, but there will be no dancing. But I'm in charge. Yours truly, Ahab. <laughs> Very pleasant good evening. I'm Artie Billiard of the Monterey County Historical Association. Before we begin, I'd like to give a special thanks to everyone who was attendance in our last session in which we discussed the Dobbins Tobacco of 1847. Anyone who has hiked Whaler's Cove, visited the Whaling Adobe, or even dined at the whaling station will increase our next segment. But tonight, we look at old Monterey's bygone days when daling sailors braved the high seas in search of that great behemoth known as the whale. Now these great aquatic monsters were not easy to find. Sailing ships would often be gone for years on end. One of the things is the whales could drive very deep and they would be underwater for several hours at a time. In the 1840s, there was no satellite, there was no GPS, there was no sonar, there was not even Google Maps. So Ahab and his crew did not use their eyes, they used their nose. For the only way to locate and follow these mammoth of the ocean was to follow, well, the wind of the whale. Catchy tool, that. How's it looking, sir? Uh, but visibility is poor. Try the other eye, sir. Did I just see that? No! 
Oh, slither and sea serpents, man. Well, haven't you learned sailor speak? Oh, listen, there's no time for long syllables out here on this mad drink. We've got to shorten our sentences. Otherwise, those fast and furious whales will swim away by the time we drag out our mad talk. Now, oh, it's... Oh, I see it's time to, for us to have a review. A dance review? No, 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 there'll be no dancing aboard my ship. Not as long as I'm in charge of the Pequod. No, it's time for us to have a review of nautical terms. Now listen up and pay attention. Now, it's not boat swain, it's bosun. And it's not before or after. It's for and aft. Do you understand? I am captain. Captain? <laughs> I am captain. There you go. I'll get that landlubber out of me yet. Now, where's the second mate? Oh, he's down the yard. Oh, well, he's down in the, down in the dumps. <laughs> no, the basement. <laughs> this is a sailing vessel. We don't have a basement. The four Thank you. 